Hello class, today we're going to continue with triangles and medians. So first we need to define what is a median. A median is a line segment joining a vertex of a triangle to the midpoint of the opposite side. So first we need to label our triangle. Here's our A, B, C vertices. So if I'm going to choose vertex B, and I need to join it to the midpoint of the opposite side. So the opposite side of vertex B is the line segment AC. So I need to find the midpoint of that line segment, which we will call D. So a median is the line segment joining this vertex B to the midpoint of the opposite side. So there we have it. Here is a median. So what does that mean? What's so special about a median? Well, we're going to continue to explore a median in GeoGebra again. So here I have a triangle ABC. I'm going to choose my vertex B again, so I need to find the midpoint between A and C. So there's my, ver there's my point D, which is the midpoint between A and C. So now I need to join vertex B to this midpoint. So let's first calculate the area of the original triangle ABC. So the original triangle ABC has an area of 12 units squared. Now if I were to look at now this median, See how it's intersected the triangle ABC, and you can now see two other triangles being formed. So I can see B, I can see the triangle BAD as well as the triangle BDC. Now if I calculate the areas of these two triangles, BAD, I see that it had an area of 6. So if this triangle BAD has an area of 6, I wonder what BDC area has to be, considering that the big triangle ABC had an area of 12 units squared. It is also 6. And that's a property of means. When you intersect a triangle such as A, B, C, and have a median running through it, this median intersects the triangle area into two equal parts. And this is always the case for any types of triangles. So in today's activity, you're going to learn about how this information can be useful when calculating measurements in a triangle.